Good morning, class. So, by the way, I am your teacher for today, Teacher Carla. So, may I request all of you to stand up for our prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits me here, ever this day be at my side, to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. At this time, we're going to check your attendance. So, who is absent? Yes, very good, because all of you are present. Okay, so before we proceed to our formally discussion, we have a four classroom rules. So the first classroom rules is sit properly. Okay, can you show me how to sit properly? Yes, very good. The second one is raise your right hand if you want to answer. Okay, if you want to answer or if you want to go outside, just ask permission. Okay, the number three is listen to your teacher. So, if your teacher is talking in front, all of you have to do is to listen, okay? Yes, very good. So, the last one is, number four is, turn off your phone. Can you turn off your phone and keep it in your bag, okay? Okay, class. So, before we proceed to our discussion, who can still remember our previous topic yesterday, okay, Jaira? About technology, ma'am. Yes, very good about technology. Okay, what is technology? Uh, technology like laptop, smartphone, and uh, computer. Yes, very good. You can still remember our previous topic yesterday. And for our motivation, we have a free activity. So this free activity is scramble words. So these are, these are the direction so arrange the scramble words okay so who wants to answer the number one okay yes very good the number two yes good job okay the last one is number three who wants to answer yes very good so for our formal class the our topic for today is all about the internet and the world wide web. So when we talk about of world wide web is the learning of theory of the internet and the web is the also uh, it is the important of learning and it is a um, present of brief development of the useful media. So the the connection between the world wide web and internet is relatively straightforward as the Monzella Foundation it is the document it is the documentation for developers at the web. By browsing the web the web through the research engine by typing in address is far from the only way to make use of the internet but is it is the one of the most familiar breaking down each term is illuminate the, this relationship further in 1969 the internet was born it's because the network crashed after the first two letters someone was had a good message ready with the telegraph almost the two up of the moon. In 1971, the first email was sent and USIC becomes a uh, first web browser. So, the father of email, the computer engineer who sent the first piece of electronic mail, died on Saturday. In 1989, the World Wide Web was invented by Tim Berners Lee. So, the web was originally uh, received and they developed to meet the demand for autom automat automatically information sharing between uh, like scientists in the universe and it is institute around the world. 
the development of social media was grouped into three eras the primitive the mid medieval and the golden era the following points highlight importance the development of these eras the first one is the primitive so when we talk about the primitive it is uh, enables the development of new per portal of exchange of message through chat so we are we are not only searching for the origin of the human but also the starting of points of mother earth the second one is medieval era so when we talk about a medieval era it is uh, uh, it is a middle age for which started around the time of the fall of the roman empire so third one is golden era so the golden era it is a facility of fast place and modern lives of advan advancement of the social media so the following are the following are some importance of development in this time so when we talk about our golden era it is a senior years that period from the 51 until the end of life a number of uh, psychological and emotional change take place during this life of stage abdullah suggests checklist in evaluating website as show below so the first one is technical consideration when we talk about of technical consideration it includes future and capabilities of the website like relevant graphics and and animation to the subject and the number two is authorship is for expon, expon the number two is authorship and sponsorship it is the important to give relevant information about the site just like for the group author who can created the site the author of the information and the references used so the next is so the number three is purpose it is objectives of using the website it should be clearly started in in the way that can purpose of highlighted and like advertising it is should the it is should the presentation of the content the number four is content so when we talk about of content it is a uh, clearly understood update and organize the audience can follow copyright the information should also be reflect on the link for the readings are given so the number five is functionality when we talk about a functionality it includes the right of use language in the content and direction the navigation of buttons are ship can it is the font it is the font color and background must be constantly observed the number six is design when we talk about a design it embodies effective use to eliminate to eliminate the future in the site like an like uh, animation sound, sound files graphics color and contrast and then the transitional page link or others and the with all guidelines of choosing appropriate website and resources you need so there are types of um, there are types of guidelines so the first is use of hypertext link so some hypertext link uh, may bring uh, it may bring to us the poor quality of web page so that can make sure that we can evaluate this web page and independently from the original web page in your research and um, the next is utilization of frames when we talk about our oh, utilization and frames uh, as it is um, it is a display separated web page that can evaluate each frame separately as well and next is out of context page it always go back to the home page of your research imagine on how to know the source of information the next is 
marketing oriented web page when we talk about of uh, marketing and oriented web page it is a web page of content that can include advertising which you can uh, you can go to an annotate annotized so we make sure that we make sure that we can advertising and infor, inform informational to context the supply of the person of organization the next is organization organization it is a blending of inter entertainment and information and advertising you can to do is to orient yourself with the page of your time allotment since website as informational you can control and the next is limitation of access to software requirements so since fall of access the web resources required additional software and may change the appearance of the web page be aware of its limitation the next is stability of of web page so when we talk about stability of web page it is a document your source to the extent possible since the some page we can disappear without notice so last one is susceptibility of web page alteration so when we talk about of this it is a very verif verifying information and credibility of the website it can will help you so it is an individual con contextual to the message factor are likely to impact on accessibility and it is a holistic approach it is proposed for the future theoretical and development of this era so the group activity the group one is give at least three types of importance of development and in the group two is what are the things that they have in the guidelines of choosing appropriate website your assignment Provide a picture about the technology and pass it on Monday.